So what does OHV or DOHC or you know whatever you see on the front of your uh, engine? Um, well, OHV means overhead valve, and um, as you can see, it says overhead valve in there. Now, overhead valve is uh, the simplest form, basically. Um, when you see OHV, most of your engines are all overhead valves. Um, your four strokes, two strokes don't have valves. Um, unless it's called a flathead, which are generally, they don't make too many of these anymore. But these are flat, this is a flathead engine. This is a fairly old lawnmower, too, so... Um, and, uh, OHV means, um, overhead valve, but not only does it have the overhead valves, but there is push rods that come up from the valves and go down inside the engine. And the engine, there's a little cam inside there, uh, that can move those valves up and down. I will draw out a diagram in a minute on what this means. So, lighting's kind of poor, but if you take a look, most V8s are actually OHV. If you take a look, you get your rods, your push rods, that go down inside the engine. And down inside here, below this surface here, there's a camshaft. And that moves the lifters, and it pushes up and moves the valves. Now all use pretty much the same concept, but you may wonder also what is DOHC. I'm sorry, I mean DOHV. So the lighting ain't too great, but this is my dad's. Uh, it's an eight. I think I'm pretty sure it's an 800 cc street bike motor. And if you look on the side there, it says DOHC. DOHC means twin um, dual overhead cams so I'm sorry I was right dual overhead cams um, if you take a look you see there's these two areas on the top here inside here are the cams and most um, engines only have one and it usually goes down inside there and it controls two rocker arms this one has two and they control lifters. Um, it controls the valves. Sorry, I'm getting myself all confused up here. And it controls the valves. This happens to be um, no, that's a single valve for each cylinder. Um, I'll get to in a minute what uh, twin valves mean too. So now I'm going to get to what SOHC means, single overhead cam, and that means sure if I'll be really going to show you this but there's only one single spot for the cam if you take a look back in here there's only one area where the cam is in and it controls two rocker arms that move the valves now my zero turn is also an HOV it's got the cam in the inside and that's the rocker cover now I'll get to what a flathead is a little better. So this is this tractor I've been trying to get running. Now a flathead works like an OHV engine. It's got the rods and stuff that all go down inside the uh, crankcase, but the camshaft is um on down inside below, and it's driven by the uh, crankshaft, and um, just like the OHV. But instead of having a rocker arm, uh, the lifters that control the rocker arms, the valves just come straight from the lifters and go up on a flat surface. And I'll get to my diagrams like right now. So like I said, I was going to draw out a diagram. So this is basically an example of a um, an OHV engine. And... As you can see, there's the timing chain coming from the crankshaft, there's the camshaft, there's the lifters, and you got the rocker arms on top and the valves. Now, usually, these are all OHV engines too, but, like I said, they usually have a few letters in front of them. Like, 
DOHC, which means dual overhead cams. There's still overhead valves, like these ones, so that's still an overhead valve engine. So it's this one. So, that's a little flathead, it's just an example, but uh, if you take a look, this is a good example of an SOHC, single overhead cam, or also it just could be an OHC, overhead cam. But the reason why we use SOHC is because overhead cam can also refer to this because and uh, DOHC because dual overhead cam, or you could say over um, overhead camps. So overhead cam, so we usually use SOHC. Um, so unlike on the um, the uh, OHV, um, the cam, the chiming chain is down inside the crankcase. That's uh, usually not always the case, and on most small engines, actually, the um, the time the uh, camshaft is driven by gears, and it's usually um, controlled by usually gear leverage that's down inside there, and um, that connects the cam. Sometimes they may even, in more rare cases, it could even be connected to the uh, crankshaft straight, but I don't think I ever really seen one of them. Uh, and this is in a over a single overhead cam. Um, you see the timing chain that goes up there. No, like unlike the push rods, it doesn't go through the piston like that. It actually just goes up on the side of the motor. Um, they're always in housed, and uh, timing chain goes up there. And on a dual overhead cam, the uh, timing chain usually always goes like that um, in some rare cases you may even have double like two chiming chains but um, that's another rare thing that you may never see a flathead works basically like these do but instead of instead of these lifters controlling onto rocker arms the valves are flat against the head take a look here they just get lifted up straight. And that it is for.